Maybe the new me will be different. A new me is exactly what the protagonist of the book Go Ask Alice by Beatrice Sparks seeks for throughout her entire journey. Like what is portrayed in the book, the protagonist seeks for a fresh start, though it's seemingly impossible to actually start a fresh life for your past will always haunt you. Set in the cities during the 1950s, the book is written in a diary format composed by an anonymous teenager. Despite the fact that the book is set in the 1950s, the book has a very modern and sophisticated feel. The protagonist of the book, who stays anonymous throughout the entire diary, is a normal 15-year-old teenage girl with a happy, supportive family. Though her life starts to decline as she finds herself sucked into the black hole of drugs. Several times she tries to put an end to her addiction, but it's not very easy and every time she's unable to restrain herself and she finds herself doing drugs again. Her addiction becomes quite severe and several events occur in consequence to her drug addiction. For example, her drug usage makes her feel very depressed and lonely. Her addiction becomes quite severe as she decides to run away from home to escape her mother and her school. During her runaway, the protagonist goes through several therapeutic moments as she meets a variety of people and goes through several ups and downs. Unfortunately, her addiction picks up again and the dreadful cycle goes on. The protagonist goes on a journey with her diary, a journey that stole her youth and her life. Yet, in some ways, a journey that helped her realize who she was. I think the theme of this book is to love yourself for who you are, because the protagonist of this book had several insecurities, and I think that may be one of the reasons why she decided to do drugs. Despite all her insecurities, she takes a journey. Although it's quite a rough path, she, in the end, she learns to love herself and it's just a really heartwarming story. I recommend this book to more mature readers who enjoy reading realistic fiction books. And I personally really like this book because I think the ending is very good. Like, it's very unexpected and just really good. So, yeah. And you should really read this book because it's really quite touching. Although some people may think it's a bit weird. I think it was like one of the really good therapeutic books I've ever